Fora TV. The world is thinking. I, I, I do want to just raise a point that I actually think social media is going away. That those of you who, go, who today call yourselves a social media guru or expert, you should find a new job. That, that, that really what we're experiencing today is sort of the evolution of communications. That, that as a society, we will start to, if not already, start to feel the effects of hyper-communications. Because whether you're connected... How many people here are on Facebook? Oh. And how many people here are tired of their friends' updates on Facebook? You should unfriend these guys, okay? The, the reality is that you're living in a time where we're getting more information about people's presence and information than we really care to process, yet we're politely not sure what to do about it. We're living in a time where the ecosystems around us are evolving quite rapidly, but I think what you're really feeling, although you're not seeing today, is the evolution of how we communicate as people. And then in the future, the communication systems will be the ones that actually drive these metaphors more connected, because they're the ones that have vested interest to help people connect, share, engage, and listen to each other much more than any particular network out there by itself. And that, while it's organic, this is a, a, a tectonic shift in how the world communicates, and that a few, in the near future, it, these networks will be, I think, more personal. I think you'll own your own data, you'll figure out how this all works, and that, that we're going to connect in, in a way that, that's much bigger than us. Uh, you know, as we get there, I think we'll, there'll be wonderful tools to help us figure out what's going on. But I think that the evolution of social media is just a transitional phrase as much as you could take advantage, you could assume that there'll be a ray of light and, and, and some, a breath of air, and there's um, a wave to look at outside in the, in the ocean, that's where I think this really goes. This is part of the human experience. And that part, what I learned from this is actually serendipity and humanity are things those people who are engaged on in social networks start to feel humanity at a level they never knew was possible because these status updates give us a sense of presence, which is hard to explain, but you can experience it as a person. And that brands that are successful in this world realize behind people their tweets. And that you can connect, that, that, there's, that there's a real level of humanity here that in caring. So I you know, caution you not to be so um, connected to social media because I really think it's the human experience.